Hi, welcome back to Stacy Lee's Life with Cerebral Palsy. I want to welcome those of you that are watching this for the very first time. And I want to welcome my new subscribers to Stacy Lee's Life with Cerebral Palsy. So guys, I have some news for you. If you have been watching my previous videos about me talking about possibly getting knee surgery, it looks like, I'm not 100% sure, because I have to go back in three weeks, which... It would be May 22nd that I go back. Um, but we took a bunch of x-rays today to see how long my leg was. And it looks like that he is going to do the surgery. So in three weeks, I have to go back and talk to him about which way he is going to do the knee fusion because I say I have to go back and talk to him about it because there are three ways that you can do the knee fusion. One is putting the metal rod in my leg and connecting it to the bone to where they fuse the bone. Don't ask me how they do that because I don't know. And I'm not a doctor. Some days I wish I was so I didn't have to go back and forth to doctors. But anyhow, that's besides the point. Um, and then there is, you can... Screw the bone together to fuse it. And then you put the third one is you put this, um, the screws and the rod on the outside of your leg. But, uh, and let it fuse, and let it fuse that way. However, in my situation, he doesn't want to do that because he doesn't feel that it's going to be beneficial because eventually you have to take that one out if you do it on the outside of your leg. Um, So, yeah, guys, I have to go back in three weeks. Um, now, I'm not sure. I'm not 100% sure if he is still going to do the surgery. I'm almost... 80% sure that he's going to want to do the surgery and the reason I say 80% is because he's talking about doing it um, in June he first he had said about putting a brace on my leg but that won't that wouldn't be beneficial for me either because I have to take that one off at some point. There's no way in the world that I would be able to sleep with that brace on. So he is really talking about doing the knee fusion for sure 
and that's only because today he really seen how much pain I was in. I was actually crying while I was at the doctor's office because I was in so much pain today. And I, I was going to videotape that for you guys, but I decided not to because... One, I'm not allowed to have video cameras in there. Two, I didn't want you guys to see me crying, even though I want to be as raw and as honest with you guys. I have a really hard time showing my emotions when it comes to crying. I don't like to cry in front of people and a million millions of you are going to be watching this so I don't like crying unless I necessarily can't take it no more and then I just let it loose but um yeah I just didn't feel right about showing that part of myself with you guys um and some of you may ask why not why not show that if you want to be as honest and raw as possible one because I didn't know if I showed that part of you guys I knew I would not be able to hold the phone still because I was crying uncontrollably like I couldn't stop because I was in so much pain I couldn't talk at one point and I wouldn't have been able to cut some of that out for you guys because I don't have that capability on my phone to do so. But anyhow, guys, it looks like we are or I should say me. I'm going to have surgery. Like I said, he's talking about doing the surgery in June. I go back to see him May 22nd, so I will, again, keep you guys updated. There will possibly be three more videos on this topic. One to let you know when my surgery is. Two... Um, right before I go in to have surgery, three, to let y'all know how my recovery is doing. Um, but again, guys, please, I don't ask this very often, but please keep me in your prayers that everything turns out the way that it should. I love you guys. Thank you for your support. If this video has helped, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already done so, please make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. So when I upload new videos, you'll be the first one to get them.
Thank you for watching Stacy Lee's Life with Saru Palsy. And thank you for your love and support. Bye for now.